The U.S. Mint has been making coins since 1793, right? And it means we're like 230 plus years and continuing going on. Yet, when you look at our history, there's only one series they put out paying tribute to those that served. And that was a couple of years ago, you might remember it. It was the 2.5 ounce, and they had the Air Force, and then the Coast Guard, right? And then the Navy, then they had the Marine Corps, then they had the Army, and it was such a successful project that people jumped all over it, 10,000 pieces, and they sold out. A lot of people were upset. So then they came back shortly thereafter with a one ounce version, same design. Well, tonight we have the rarest of the group, and in my opinion, one of the most beautiful designs. It's time to talk the Coast Guard. So Coast Guard was number two, Air Force was number one, and as I referenced, then it was Navy, Marine Corps, and then the Army in flow. So in 2022, a couple of years back, they start introducing the one ounce version so people could dive in. Couple of things. The reason why all of the designs on these special armed services, one ounce silvers, is, so, is because they made them in high relief. Now the Air Force was the fighter jet pilots and you could see into the cockpit, really cool. But for me, I just thought this, the ship's coming right at you and it doesn't look like a flat blob it's just it looks like it's coming right at you how special with just the techniques and innovations that are out there today in minting product of which some of them are u.s mint is even using so here is the two options we have available here tonight i don't have many of them but i did want to spend a couple of seconds talking about them the original government package which is the one we saw a second ago on the top shelf, right? Look at our price, we're at $75. Find a place that can beat us on that one. It's a great, great, great price. And we always have those available. Uh, right now we're down to our last few. The bottom coin, the coin you're looking at right now is the key. And why is it the key? Well, the Air Force, there are 752 of them in 70. The Navy, there are 700, 471 of them in 70. The Marine Corps, there's 450 of them. Now, the Army just came out, so it'll, we'll have numbers in three or four months. But right now, the Coast Guard in 70 is only 426 coins known. The piece in the bottom, less than 500 known in 70. Now, my competition, they're north of 200. The lowest price we found was 200. And then it was like 225, 250. But with only 426 known, not many to talk about at all. But in today's marketplace, we've been told a couple of things, right? Quality matters, and it's that way with all collectibles. We also were told low mintages, how few of something are made, are important. And in this case tonight, we match them together. The very low mintages on these one ounce silvers made in tribute to that of our armed services tonight, the Coast Guard, and then how few of them are known in 70. Guys, we got to put a 30 second clock up. I only had 12 of those one ounce in 70s, and we're already, the phones are lit. Thank you. AVCcoins.com, if you're joining us there, make sure you push your order through the shopping cart. I know this is a short chat on some very special pieces, but a lot of interest and excitement. Probably for the design, probably for what it is, and maybe for how rare it is as well. We've nailed this one. All three corners are covered. All you got to do is pick up the phone and give us a call and enjoy. Love this piece.